Hey guys, Dorf Raven 2012 here, and welcome to my Let's Play of Battlefield 1's campaign on the PlayStation 4. So this is the prologue of the campaign, and obviously as you read before here, uh, we're not meant to survive, but we'll try our best to survive as long as possible. Thank God that was behind that wall. They get him or I still alive. Oh, you guys can keep on coming. Come on, baby. There's the machine gun ammo. I think I have my leaning feature enabled on my controller. I know I have it enabled on uh, Battlefield 4, which I quite enjoyed. Fuck. You guys, uh, three bullets left. Okay, uh, no bullets left. Uh, well, I guess I'll use my grenades. Eat. Shit. Oh, that's the flamethrower class. I have, up oh. Ammo, ammo, ammo. Wow, oh, I was about to say I picked up a gun with no ammo. Oh shit, shit, reload. Oh crap, 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 reload. Uh, see what kind of bullshit happens, like there's no way of surviving this. So if you manage to survive the waves of enemies, so many of us and the flam for a guy, they'll end up just a in your position. Let me tell you. 
It was no adventure. So it's kind of bullshit that you really can't survive, but I mean the game does warn you about it. What? Are you still alive? Seriously? Fucking blow up, D bag. Gonna make sure my men survive. I'll swap my uh, pistol for a gear. Got someone setting my ass on fire. Oh, bullshit off that range. Crap, 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 survive, 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 survive. Wow. Last time I survived this area much longer, but oh well. I've already uh played for the campaign uh, on hard and I got all my trophies for the game. Luckily they were mostly on our side. Mostly. That was the one thing I don't like about Battlefield uh, 1. I don't like that you're forced to be uh, in this first first person perspective, don't get me wrong, while it looks cool and stuff. It's really hard to uh, know if like enemies are like around you or not. Yeah, what the hell? Please don't let I kill you. I take that as a no. Ah, oh, yeah, shit, I had the machine gun too. I kept forgetting about that. Yeah, you dirty Nazis. Well, you dirty Germans. I mean, this is before you guys uh, became Nazis and stuff. Dude, why is the sensitivity, uh. So dead fucking um slow. Um God, it feels really sluggish slow, I don't know why. I don't think the campaign has its uh, separate sensitivity setting. Yes, sir. Good shot. Why now? I do like that you unlock um, stuff for the multiplayer by playing for the single player, finding the collectibles, just beating the campaign, and so on and so forth. You don't lock anything for beating the campaign on hard for the multiplayer, so that's that's kind of a letdown, but eh. And it's not like the game's hard on hard anyway, it's fairly easy, it's just um... I think the first uh, ch chapter of the campaign was the hardest one because of uh, the tank being really easily taken out. But yeah, after you get past the first chapter, the rest of the game is just super easy. Fucker. Do I still have to wear this stupid fucking mask? Fuck you, Nazi. I mean, German. Uh, whatever. Dude, take off the fucking mask. There we go. 
One flying fur kit down. Dude, take off the fucking mask. I could have sworn you were able to take the fucking mask off. Because you can't aim while uh, having the mask on, which is, again, a, a stupid feature, but I can see why they did that. Huh. That's hilarious. I could actually, uh... It was the first time doing this, actually. I never, uh... Ran past them. This is my first time actually doing this, holy shit. Ah, there comes the artillery strike that you're not supposed to survive. Oh well. I do give it to DICE, they always impress with the graphics, like they always try to step up their game. Unlike Activision with Call of Duty, where the game still does, almost looks the same like it did in 2007. We push. We push. Every once in a while, we push hard enough that the light breaks through the cloud. It's in a world beyond the war glimmers. Just out of reach. The war is the world, and the world is the war. But behind every gun sight is a human being. We are those people. We are the jaded, we are the naive, we are the honorable, and the criminal. We are the bound for legend and the loss to history. We are the knights of the sky, the ghosts in the desert, and the rats in the mud. These are our stories. <laughs> 